all right so i'm going to show you how to install linux kali on your mobile phone so if you are wondering how to um, get linux kali on your mobile phone i'm going to show you a step-by-step guy can you just can you follow the step-by-step -step? and if you follow it you are not going to have any problem you are going to do it on the phone too and um, practice ethical hacking right on your phone you know don't, don't need only a laptop if you don't have a pc or if you if you are out and you want to practice something you can do it right on your phone without going to your laptop so i'm going to show you so follow me all right so to begin this installation um let us go ahead to you have to download um in f droid first so just go to your internet and just go to chrome and you can just come to this part um just download f droid so just search search f droid f droid just f droid every download a kit on enter and then you should have so this f droid so you can so come download it the apk file so you can just come to softonic to download the apk file so down this is the apk file right so after you download it fine so then you go ahead to uh after you have done with that download just go to the f droid go to f droid and then you are going to download 10 bits download the temus from f droid so just come to this part and just search just search temus and then you should have temus so you should have temus terminal uh, so just go through so you see temus terminal and i think so i think this one that's it that's it so that's the temus ter terminal this one and you see i have installed my i have installed it all right so we just have to come and install temus terminal with terminal emulator with packages this one so just install Temis. When you are done, that's fine. Then you you are you are free to go. So you are now going to install something you call Net Hunter Net Hunter Store. So just go back to your um, your your browser, okay, and just come to the site and just search Net Hunter Net Hunter Store Net Hunter Store. Then you click on and send it. So this will send you to this main directory. Now come here and just go to download um, download app download store app right so make sure your phone is either on the desktop mode or i mean, I mean you have turned it to a landscape so click on download now to give you this link so this link you're going to give just tap on the link tap on the link and to send you to f um, it sent to f droid to send it to f droid so so here if I, so you're going to use this one going to use this one the android deep link tap on it and then you're going to send it to um f droid so go to f droid I mean, go to just once and then this will so it will give you to allow you to um add this repository so go ahead to add a repository and that is all so go back and um, go back to f droid go back to f droid and then you're going to download something that we call i mean net hunter store so you just have to come into and then and then search net hunter store net hunter store all right net hunter store so you see it is here so net hunter store so at this one this one i have done i've done i've downloaded this so you see so you see net hunter store so download it all right so when you are done with the download then you are free to go so after you have downloaded come back and open the net hunter store so let me search my net hunter store so this is my net hunter store so when you come into the net hunter store you just have to come to this search bar uh, this search icon there now you're going to search what we call the keks the keks so you have to say the keks k-e-x keks so you see keks and then you should have net hunter keks so you see this one this will you download net hunter keks all right so that's it so tap on it and then you just download it so i've now i've downloaded the mine all right so i don't have any problem yeah so now that is all now you should have you should have you should have uh, you should have keks you have keks here and then you you have temus temus is there temus is there and then you have the uh, the net hunter all right so now having done that let's go to let's open our temus all right so when you come to um your net so you come to temus like this okay the first thing you're going to do is that you have to ensure that you have set the storage all right set your storage and then so let's go and then just use this command temus just see uh temus temus and then we're just going to see hyphen you're going to set up the storage so you just have to say set up uh set up 
hyphen and then storage you want to set the storage so that they can take and mind you you should get um some space on your on your on your phone so go enter now it sets up the storage for you if it allows you to give permission just allow it so just give some time for you to uh, set the storage then we can continue all right so now you see it's asking me for permission so click on allow and then your storage is set and now your storage is now set so let's go ahead to change the repository so just go by the command temus temus hyphen change the repo so you're going to change the uh, repo oh it's change uh this one is so terminus hyphen change repo let's hit on enter now it thanks you this one so you go yes use the main yes yeah, select the main um, mirror group just hit on enter now it's so you have these um uh, what do you call it mirrors so uh, just just go by you can go by all the mirrors so let me just click on enter to select all the mirrors and allow it for the mirrors to um, be updated and for before we continue so allow it for the update to be done all right so very good so now let's go ahead to install our update for us so let's check for the next update so let's say pkg pkg update all right we want to check for updates and then we install so update hit on enter and then all right so now let, let's go ahead to update up, up, upgrade so pkg pkg upgrade so let's upgrade our system packages for us so uh, let's say upgrade so enter so it will upgrade very good when you are pointed just hit on y to go ahead and all the upgrades must be installed and then we continue all right so choose the default hit on end to choose the default one all right go ahead with n for the fourth one and n again for the fourth all right so now we have done so let's go ahead to install our get so let's go and say pkg pkg we are going to install i mean the get um two so let's do install so install install the we get hyphen y the we get then hyphen y hyphen y so that's what we said so pkg install the we get hyphen y hit on enter for you to have get installed very good so now it's get is now installed uh, let us go ahead to now so we are going to install the kali we're going to install the mini kali so i'm going to give you the link so the link will be another the, the videos the description session uh, to be in the form of a document go in and take the document and then you copy the link from there so i'm going to let me paste the link let's paste so after it let's paste the link there let's paste the link here so now this is actually the link or the um, the script to install net hunter so let me hit on uh, enter for the script to be installed now the script is now installed just let's find items inside so you buy just listing the items the ls and then so this is what we have so this is the main program that we have there so let us give permissions to, then we can run it so this one is not executable let's make it executable so by just going on the command ch mode uh, ch mode all right so this command always um then is plus and x so it's plus and then x then let's copy the program uh, and then and then copy it and then let's paste it here let's paste it there so it will 
to give permission to wait and then make it executable so now it stands for if i list again to so see that we have permission so now you see now it's in the green it's in the green color means that we have permissions to run it so now how do you run it? just go by dots and then forward slash the forward slash then let's paste uh, let's paste the, the same thing let's paste it there the same thing just copy the same thing paste it there hit on enter for it to run so very good so kali very good so kali is now installed so allow it at this point just allow it to be stored it will take some time to allow it to be installed then you can go ahead it's, it's, it's about it's about to finish so let's allow it to finish and then we continue so you see it's now about 99 percent so let's allow it to finish and we can continue with with it at this point allow it to extract allow it to extract the root fs file so when it gets to this point just allow it don't do anything just allow it it will extract the root fs file then we delete it then we can go ahead all right so um so delete the root fs just choose um choose y to delete it and let me tell you something this at this point it may delay so it depends on network you know the extraction of the the extraction of the root fs may take quite uh, longer depending on the network so if you have a good network there the extraction will not take long but if you have, your network is not that strong it may take quite a bit a bit longer for for the extraction to be done so you just have to be patient for for it to have this interface then you click on you just choose y to continue click on y and then um so de delete um so choose y to delete root fs file so choose y to delete it and then that continue bye bye so very good so now this is our this is the net hunter or this is the kali so you have this interface so the first thing you're going to do so you are going to change the password so uh, let's ch um, copy this um this command just co copy this one copy and then come to this part we want to change our password so uh, oh let's come to this part here so uh, let's copy this one and then go to copy then come to this part and paste it so enter then you are asked to enter your password so choose your password so let me enter my password so i'm choosing and then the password will not show so but you have to be, be careful what you type so it will not show there all right so i'll choose this one then enter oh, okay so by must be six so let me choose again all right let me go in again then all right hit on enter all right so would you like to um, view only so you just have to choose uh, choose choose why choose why choose why to go ahead and then so enter your password and then i want to choose um the view only password so that one to uh let me go let me go uh, i choose let me go by the same password yeah all right all right so i'm going by the same password very good so now we are done we are done so now let's go ahead to uh launch um or to run kali so how do you run kali uh, so you just have to come to this part just you just going to use this command so net hunter uh this command net hunter kex and 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 the, the ampersand sign so we just have to copy this command copy it and then you just have to paste it here then you run it okay so you are just paste it here and then you just hit on enter to run it so very good so all right all right so we are going to set it up very good so so make sure you take note of the items you see here the r fb rfb port make sure you take note of the rfb ports all right so uh, we are going to um run set up our kali with the RF, uh, rfb port and then so please take note of this one and let's go ahead so uh, let's 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 go let's go ahead to so it's five nine zero one five nine zero one so now let us go to our so let's go to our uh let's go to Okay, so let's go to to our net hunter kicks so uh let's go to net 
heck let's go to let hunter kex so let's go to this one let hunter kex then open it all right so when you open the so let me allow it and then you come to this part so when you open the net counter case you have this one so you're going to change the port all right so come to this part you see this one so you see this is the port so this is actually okay let, 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 let me make it for you to know so yeah so when you come here when you come to this part so this is the uh, vnc port so come here choose it it was five nine zero one so here let me let uh, make it one all right and then your yeah your password that you choose so mine i choose one two three four five six i choose this all right as my password and then when you are done just have to yes everything is so they have to cl click on connect and then let's see what happens so um, um yeah so this is where we are now so you see that now our kali is right installed all right so uh, okay so go to so let, let me go to this part and let me just have to close it this one all right so this so you see this so this is our kali and we have kali right on our phone so you see kali is just on our phone uh like like that so this kali can just go ahead to go you can go ahead to go any place that you want this is your home um then you can just go ahead to to do the anything it's like exactly as your machine all right so just go there to close everything so now this is how the whole thing goes so you can actually change if you want to change the input you can change the input method you can use uh, i mean direct uh, you can use direct direct to direct swap here you can choose any other thing you can choose um if you want to go by a simulated uh, all right so how about if you want to disconnect if you want to disconnect it you just have to go back let's go back to disconnect you just have to come back to our terminal and then here you're going to say that net hunter and uh, net hunter uh, net hunter net hunter all right and then it's it's case all right so you just have to say case and then you, you know and then you just have to oh, so case and then you stop all right so this will actually stop the kali so now it will stop kali for you so now uh so as you see now we have stopped kali all right so now we have stopped it so if you go there it's not working again all right so you see now we have stopped we have stopped it so if you want to connect you just have to go back and just go by the command net hunter net, hun net hunter kicks and end and then you just have to connect. so that's how you connect your net hunter i mean just connect your kali on your mobile phone so now this is my mobile phone and i can run kali on it if you want to start again just go by the command net hunter just go by the command this command just command just go by this command if you want to connect just go by this command net hunter kicks if you want to stop it just go by the command net hunter kicks and then stop it will i mean stop the whole thing so that's how you run kali on your mobile phone all right